Hello everyone, so in this particular video we are going to discuss about the rank transformation in Azure Data Factory. So generally we use a rank transformation to generate a order ranking based on the sorting condition. So in a SQL also right, suppose you have given a employee ID and you have given a salary. So based on the salary, they are descending order if you want to generate a rank. So in this kind of the scenario, what actually we can use a, we can use a rank transformation. So you can use a rank and also you can use a dense rank so it is similar to the sql there we have a rank and the dense rank concept right here also we can apply a rank and the dense rank with the help of the rank transformation itself let's take a example and with that example let's understand so i have one of the data set you can see alter row.csv this is the data i have employee id name country and the salary so what i want to do based on the descending order of the salary i want to assign a, a rank for that so what i will do i'll go to the data factory I'll click on the new data flow in the new data flow plus I will create a source so I already created a data set so I'll select that this is the text I have if I show you the data go to the data preview if I refresh it I should be able to preview my data now after that what we have to do click on the plus here you can see we have a rank transformation this is the rank transformation so in the rank transformation you can see we get an option like the whether you want to have a case sensitive or if you want to have a dense rank that's also you can select that but first you have to assign what is the new column you want to create i want to create a new column as a, a rank salary something i want to create based on the rank salary i want to create and after that you have to apply a sort condition so based on which particular condition you want to have a this ranking so I based on the salary and their descending order i want to have so i select the salary and the descending now if you will click on the data preview i should be able to get a rank based on the descending order of the salary so you can see but here you can see salary 5000 it is showing a rank one but based on the descending order we have selected right you can see this salary is a abc format this is a string format so first we have to convert this into the integer so that kind of the problem generally we see so what you have to do go to the source go to the source projection this salary you can convert this into the integer now if i will come to the rank if you will refresh it now you should be able to preview data correctly based on the descending order of the salary we should get a rank you can see the highest salary is 24,000 so it assigned a rank 1 20,000 2 20,000 2 17,000 10,000 5,000 so like that actually we can use a rank transformation so i hope you got the idea after that you just had to add a sync location and the same kind of the operation you can do that